minds. Yeah. It never was. It never will be. It's mothers. Those hollyhocks over there, they're mothers, even though Sharon planted them. The barn, too. Every last stick of it. And the house, and the chicken coop, and all those fields over there, they're always mothers. Even when dad was still around. And even though Sharon and I lived here, too, there's never been any doubt in my mind who really owns the place. I've known that my whole life. Chick, 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 come here, you fat, stupid, greedy, good for nothings. Come over here and stuff yourselves. That's right. Hey, Mom. Hey, Jimmy. Come over here. Brownie, you come in here and get your share. Brownie looks sick, Mom. Here, let me feed her. Spoiled rotten, that hen. But if she thinks I'm going to treat her like a queen, she's got another thing coming. Can chickens really think? I swear that one can. Look at her eat, will ya? She probably knows that if she isn't smart enough, she'll end up at Sunday dinner. <laughs> no, not Brownie. You never touch Brownie, would you, Mom? Well, if it's left up to your father, she'll die of old age, that's for sure. Dad can't kill anything. He told me. It's me that knows it. If it ever came to choosing between us starving to death and some animal living off the fat of the land, we'd all end up with pretty empty bellies, I can tell you. Last you killed Candace for Thanksgiving. <laughs> <laughs> By the time conceited old buzzards strutting around the barn like you own the place. Got rid of old Stephen Lyons, too. <laughs>
You think a man can get on nothing but working in the fields and paying bills? Other men do. And how would you know? Maybe they're no better than me. Maybe they're desperately lonely. Fed up with nothing to live for, but more of the same. This has got to stop, Gerald. You and that girl! You stay out of it! You got Jimmy and the farm, and that's all you've ever been interested in anyways. What more do you want? I want everything to stay the same. Just the same as it's always been. I've got a heavy day of work tomorrow. I'm going to bed. Nobody knows. <laughs>